Okay, anything else? Guess I'll drink some water for some extra stuff. Okay, utilities. Unlock... Oh! Okay, let's unlock the processing terminal for eels. I might be able to get a whole bunch of eel snacks from here. Two emails. Price, I've always had your back, but you're pushing things too far right now. You have to get a grip. People are noticing. Price, people higher up the food chain than us. Quit avoiding Dr. Cole and just go talk to him. I believe you can get us through this. Let me help M. Working under the influence. Hello, Price. According to the information I've received, you pose a danger to yourself and those around you. I cannot overstate the seriousness of attempting to perform your duties on this station while under the influence of alcohol. I've written a prescription for you. You must take the medication. Refrain from alcohol and remain in crew quarters until we can meet. You are temporarily suspended from duty and Chief, Chief Ilyushin has occur concurred. Okay. Yeah, so the the guy that uh, that works in water or eel treatment or whatever was a complete lush. Okay, water quality lab. Oh, Pablo Myers. Okay, so we've got one of those guys, but I don't think he's going to be able to get to me. We get a wrench. More vodka. Nothing else. Okay, uh, yeah. I don't see any other particularly easy access routes through here, so I guess we'll just take this one. Oh, come to think of it, I, I haven't been up here. Is there even anything useful? Not really. Unless there's like a, a way to go up or elsewhere or no? Okay. Works out. That actually works out really well. Okay. Watching me play this game is like watching a really long horror movie. Dude, it is. Though it's getting a little bit less horror-y as I, as I get better and better at the game. It's also getting laggier and laggier. Should probably call it quits soon anyway. It is bedtime soon. Organic material, that's not what I need. Hey, Neuromods! Organic mineral material. I think it's mineral that we need the most of. Okay, anything else? Just that guy. We really do need to uh, go go somewhere at some point, sit down and be like, uh, we need to... Did I? Nope. Didn't loot that guy. It'd be nice if I could get a checklist. Like, not just on the terminals, but like an actual official checklist. Um, for like, all the people in the entire, uh, I guess in the entire station, uh, so that I can... I'm gonna say catch them all, but I know that's wrong. Okay. Yeah, so, seeing as we're loaded on snacks, let's, um... Let's actually recycle everything that could potentially... Okay, maybe not that one, but, like, these? That'll give us a decent amount of, uh... Of physical... Or mineral... Resources. And we'll save everything that we don't need. Spare parts, I, I could also potentially salvage some, because we really don't need that much. Okay, anything else? Not really, because yeah, we've only got 60 mineral yield, which actually is not so bad. Uh, we're, start we're starting to pull back up. And then I'm immediately just going to... Uh, We're immediately going to just burn through most of it. Small chance I might, uh... We'll, we'll see how things go. Unfortunately, since enemies are starting to respawn here, we might run into... We might actually start running into ammo problems, which is really concerning to me. Anyway, um... So we have the treatment center. Oh, right. Oh, that was power. Were there other things? I have no idea. We've got, like, some side objectives, like, uh... Psychic water. Find four more dropper points around Talos. Recover the goods hidden in them. Okay, so there are four more. I'll have to figure out where they are. Uh... No idea. Yeah, I don't know if, uh... 
I don't know if psychic water is a good thing. Do we do it? What do you guys think? Psychic water or no? Oof. I don't, I don't know what it is. It might be all the special effects around here. No, no, and... I'm getting a lot of no's. A couple of yeses. At least look at it. Sure. Oh! Eel processing. Can I... Hello. Harvest eels. Oh, shit. Regeneration one available. Oh shit. You know just how to tempt me, game. Damn it. Alright, whatever. Yeah, we got a eel mimic. Okay, eel tank maintenance manual. So this is the guy that was probably a complete drunk and died. Eels do a pretty good job of eating up all the waste. There's buildup that even the eels can't clean off, so we have to scrape the tank every month. First, run the harvesting utility to clear it, clean out any clear out any mature eels. The utility is on the tank workstation. When that's done, you can enter the tank. I'd also suggest shutting off the effluent flow valve, unless you like taking a shower in your co-worker's toilet water. And please watch your step. Eels are mostly blind, but they have a nasty bite. And you don't want to be wounded in that water, trust me. So that's Price Broadway. All right, um... Okay. One way or another, we got a thing I want to do before before I go too far. Damn it, stop bouncing. It'll have to do. I mean, we've got a pile of eels here. It's like asking to get uh recycled. Okay. So do we have anything else around here? I I'm going to start small then go big. Leverage 3. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to move that there. Why is Price covered in eels? Because, uh, he died in there. Uh, I think it- I think it's because he was a drunk. But I could be wrong. Um, I, I think he was the- the drunk guy that, uh, they were warning, like, you know, you gotta stop this. And so he was in the eel tank up there. He could have committed suicide or something. Too. That- that is also an option. Um, but, uh, so, Price was in the tank with the eels. I don't know. There's not too much to say, t to be totally honest. What was that? Oh, that's just, that's just shiny. Okay. I can't pick up any of these. Leverage three would be nice. How many Neuromods am I loading right now? All right, fine. Can you recycle the dead? Yes. Oh, speaking of... Found some of the dead. There's a body under here. I had no idea. I don't think I'm gonna find all the dead crew members. I mean, it could. We could actually just locate everybody. Okay. Yield tank, leverage three. Yeah, repair three would be nice. Would be. But... I think... It's best if I... I, I think it's best if I go... Uh, carrying capacity first. I've been wanting to do this for ages anyway. And seeing as the game is kind of non... I'm not gonna say it's non-functional, but I don't want to be progressing to harder areas with it, uh, slowing down this badly. So instead, we're going to, uh... We're going to recycle literally everything in waste treatment. 
I'm just happy we found the eels. Because that was something I was looking for. Okay. Yeah, she crawled under a box and got crushed. Yeah, probably. Uh, I noticed the game runs substantially slower when I pick one of these things up. Okay, there we go. I love the fact that I can chuck these so far. We are one strong person. Help. No. Um, well, I guess that's just stuck there. Uh, ooh, right? Ooh, okay, that didn't not feel like coming along. Damn it. How hard is it to chuck one of these things? Okay, there we go. We're gonna cause some serious damage. I'm not even sure if a recycling grenade's even gonna be able to get all of these things. Oh, that one. That one was in a hurry to go down there. Okay, can I pick up anything else? Cynthia Dringus. I don't know if I can chuck her. Yep, there she goes. Okay. More eel tanks. Wonder why. I don't know. It's better than just leaving her body there. It's not like a Viking funeral, but you know. It's a funeral. Ooh. Yeah, big old girder. That that Sounds like something if I can carry it. Ugh. There we go. And fortunately, the recycling grenades did not exactly have the greatest of range, so I'm not entirely sure if this is all going to work. But that's okay. All right, we got couple more, couple more uh, subjects here. I could just imagine Alex watching this. <laughs> I can just imagine a couple of people who still have, like, a uh, security cam access being like, What the hell is he doing? No! There he goes. There's just a whole pile of no-good nicks down there. Well, I guess I can toss the cargo down, too. I originally thought these were just, like, fabric or plastic or whatever. Oh, jeez. Okay, that's doing some things. But yes. Actually, okay, so I'm actually operating under a bit of a, uh, a theory here. Uh, and this is actually a good time to talk about it. So, I get the feeling this game is actually one of those classic, um, it was a dream all along kind of games. I think this is a simula simulation. I don't think we're Morgan. Like, I, I legitimately do not believe we are Morgan you, actually. Um... I, I don't I don't believe we're Morgan Yu. I think we're either okay, we could be Morgan Yu, or we could be like uh Morgan Yu on a loop still. And they're uh they're still checking his personality drift and stuff like that. Cause earlier we had um we had evidence of this when um January was like, you know, how could you do that? You know, this is what separates us from the uh the Typhons. And um and then uh, a couple other like logs and stuff like that. Um, and so I get the feeling that this is all one big giant test to see either A, is, uh, is, is Morgan Yu a complete loon, or theory B, we're not Morgan Yu at all, and, um, we're not Morgan Yu at all, we never were, we are a Typhon with, uh, with empathy, uh, neurons or whatever, because they'd, uh, because Alex had mentioned that earlier, that, uh, the Typhons lacked those. And so, uh, we, we could be a, a Typhon with, with Miron neurons being led through this to see what would happen, you know, would they empathize, would they do the right thing, so on and so forth. 
I hurt myself with his flying body. Huh. But yeah, so, um... Okay. First we check this. Oh, it just doesn't let us in. Okay. But yeah, I, my, my personal favorite theory is... B. Because that is like the bananas option. Huh. Just gonna spit eels there. I'm just gonna pile everything... on that corner, I think. Oh. Kind of made a mess in there. People call me Morgan Yu. But the thing is, we're, we're a simulation. Like, if we're in a simulation, anything could be simulated here. So, anybody could call us Morgan Yu. We, I mean, for all intents and purposes, we could be, we could be Morgan Yu, we could be Alex Yu. We could be... Any of them. And I have... Ow! Okay, hit myself with that too. Okay, don't think I can do too much with that. Let's just check the other eel tank in. Okay. Oh, I got a ton of these. Okay, that exploded into a bunch of goodies. Getting a lot of organics. Bodies might not actually be recyclable here, by the way. Oh, it's okay. I wasn't really using these anyway, so it's kind of... kind of nice to clear them out. Okay, what is this? Oh, that's a Greater Mimic's corpse. Anything else? Looks particularly... I'm just gonna check... Chuck them all in here. Oops. Guess the eel tank thing is... Not gonna move. Or... Now it is. Weird that it's rolling now freely in the direction I want to go. Holy shit, look at all that. Alright. Uh, if I can get up here, synthetic material, mineral material. Fortunately, these aren't netting me quite as much as I'd like, but that's okay. Kind of makes this, like, explosive sound. At least it is getting me quite a lot of mineral material. Which is handy. Not as much as you'd think from a steel girder, though. Like, you'd think those things would, uh... Would give you quite a lot. Let's see, can you place them on things? Yeah, but I don't know how to do that. Well, that's okay. So we just re recycled everything. And we'll probably meet the real Morgan Yu by the end of the game. I have no idea. Like, this game could go in any direction. It's kind of fascinating. And I actually really appreciate it. I'm just expecting it's got some kind of crazy twist ending. And instead of something straightforward, because if this is supposed to be like a, a spiritual successor to System Shock of all things, then there's no way this ends normal. Okay, so I think we've been through the whole area. We have psychoactive water, but I don't care too much about that. It's waste processing. Done that, done that, been up there, been up there. Except for that one room that we can't get into, because we need a key card for that. <laughs> How about we blow the station up with a giant recycling bomb? <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Oh, let's go back and uh, recycle the last of this stuff. I think the bodies did get recycled, just not the one. Oh, wait. Power plant. That's not the direction I want to go yet. But yeah, this this game definitely has some kind of cra 
crazy twists. Or several. Who knows? Uh, because, I don't know, Bioshocks, System Shock, just all of them. Just feels obligatory or something. Okay, so let's get, get the last of our materials. We're still pretty poor on it, but we're doing better. Uh, I'm, I'm not as worried about ammo anymore. Press the mouse one to place them. Oh, in interesting. I was trying that. I guess we could always... Wait, are these bloody footprints? Oh, probably boot prints. Let's see, if you expect a twist ending, is it really a twist ending? No. <laughs> Okay, let's get some let's get some disruptor batteries now that I'm actually loaded on on these things. They're kind of worth their weight. Okay, now that we've done that, I've got a decent amount of those. Get shotgun shells. I feel so bad for my inventory from this. Oh, it's okay. Maybe, uh, between sessions, I might actually do a, a sit-down and, uh, clear some things out. Okay, so we're up to... Yeah, let's keep going. I know we need pistol ammo. I just... I use the shotgun so much. It'd be a mistake not to load up. We've got a fair amount of pistol ammo. Uh, pistol... ammo left. Alright, and there's all my materials. Well, that's okay. Yeah, I think I'll probably go find another place to... I'll find another place to grind resources after this. Have I... Did I... I never went this direction. Okay. Oh, hello. No new data. Oh. Okay, that was a mistake. I fell down a hole. I didn't know I could. Let's see, is the shotgun usually my go-to gun in games? Uh, yes. And yes, I will do grinding off stream. Well, there goes one. What's the other one? Kirk Remmer. Interesting. Weakness glue. Haven't really messed around with that. Alright. So where is Kirk? So we found Kirk's tracking bracelet and transcribe. Malika, this is Kirk Rimmer. We're in escape pod 89. Everyone is secured, but the launch controls aren't responding. Did you follow all the steps on the launch card exactly? Yeah, the klaxon even sounded, but the hatch won't close. We can't separate. Hang on. I'm looking at the schematics. There should be a remote sensor on the explosive bolts. Alika, please, hurry! I see all the leads, but... Wait, this can't be right. Can you launch us from there? Can you at least close the goddamn hatch? Uh, no, I don't think so. Is there a manual crank of some sort? Remmer. Remmer, do you copy? Man, she was useless. Oh god, I hate I don't know, I hate people like that. And it's just like somebody's clearly in a hurry. I'm sorry. Please slow down. Yeah, freaking she was way too calm compared to him. But I guess a lot of people didn't even get the memo. And it was until it was too late. Have you seen Price? <sighs> what? He didn't show up for a shift again. He's not answering his transcribe. I even asked Abigail to check his cabin before she came in. HR is gonna ship his ass home for sure this time. He was already on thin ice. Thought he was doing good. With the Naltrex on? Seeing Dr. Cole? I'll call security and have them track him down. Hopefully, he's okay. 
Okay. Well, I'll have to get some more neuro mods too. Because, yeah, I want to get repair three. I wish I could leave like a note in here. Well, oh well. We'll get that next time. But yeah, she was very much not giving a shit while he was pretty much dying. One thing is the character faces are a little rough. Well, part of it is, uh, none of the characters in this game are really meant to be seen or talked to. So, they only show up occasionally. I like how they look. They don't have Uncanny Valley. They just look kind of garbage. But... I guess I have... a harder time caring about that. Uh, comparatively, because this game is not meant to... People aren't meant to be interacted with. My only real complaint about the faces is that there's too many characters with the same face. Like, literally the same face. Uh, because they've got, I want to say about... What do we think? About 100 NPCs total? And, um... I'd say maybe there's... There's about 10 different male and female faces with, like, different hair and stuff like that. Tops? It's probably even less than that. Um... And so you end up with characters that have, like, the exact same, like, glowery face and then, like, a slightly different, uh, different hairdo. So, yeah, it looks weird, but, um... Honestly, since they're all just dead bodies and sometimes they're horribly disfigured, I give it a pass. Interesting that we've got the music. I don't know. Either way, next thing for me to do, I guess, is to... ...to go onto the power plant. I guess I'll stick my head in there, but then I'm probably gonna go else elsewhere. <sighs> but yeah, I, I do like the style, but since we never talked to anybody, it doesn't matter. If this was, um... If this is a game where you actively interacted with anybody, I'd say it would be different. And it'd actually be really nice if you did interact with some of these people. Holy shit. Oh, no. Just a pair of cystoid nests. Okay. I was a little bit worried we had something a little bit more dangerous to deal with. Actually, in retrospect, that could be a problem. At least the lag goes away whenever I... Go out. Any more of them in there? Doesn't look like it. Okay, we're all good. Like cystoid nests. All you have to do is just toss some glue at them and they go down. Okay. Good cop, good cop. I already read that one. No password. Can hack that. Let's keep looking around for a second. Starbender, book five. Okay, that's something for later. I'm still looking for book one. Nothing else? Nothing else? Okay, well, let's hack our way in. Okay. Yep. Let's see. Z, and we're good. What do we got in here? Utilities. Area map. I love area maps. They're so good. Okay. Engineering control. All personnel are required to check in. Grant access. I have no idea what that's going to do. Oh, that opened the door. Somebody's dead. Not me. I'm doing fine. Okay. Oh, we do have a... Requesting new operator. We do have an engineer on his way. Okay. Transfer. I love the the fact that these guys are on hand nearly at all times. Brenda Cabrera. Okay. Coming 
through. Aperture cleared. Operator deployment resuming. Did he just die? He did, dumb bastard. Eh, whatever. That's fine. He just went into the electrified zone. Then, Yuyin. You were looking for me? Yeah, uh, what's the story on Michaela's office? I filed an incident report. Uh, well, I'm sure it's a page turner, but I don't have time. I need to get a crew on the other side of that breach. So what's the problem? The problem is it's blacker than my butthole at the bottom of a well in there. The grounding resistor malfunctioned. Swap a new one and you should have your lights. Is that all? Hey, you sound rattled. What's up? I tried replacing the resistor yesterday. And? And it just melted into some kind of goo. Smelled like fried ass. Shit, man. That's not in the report, is it? <sighs> I need to get some sleep. My shift's over anyway. Maybe you'll have better luck. Oh, that's weird. Anyway, we got a friend there. And yeah, do we go for it? Probably will. So there's a grounding... Oh. Grounding resistor broken. So I could carry that with me, maybe. Well, for the time being, I'm not going to bother. We're just going to save. Coolant chamber. We're gonna figure out where all of our friends are. Actually, it seems pretty quiet. Just a bunch of corrupted operators and stuff like that. Oh, well. At least we know how to take him out with minimal problems. Oh, I got a weapon upgrade kit now that I'm thinking about it. Uh, let's see. Where are you, Disruptor? Thank you. Upgrade. Uh, let's do shots. Shots between reload. I'm not entirely sure how, how that'll track. I don't have any more upgrade kits, do I? Yep, I don't. I know Q-Beam's in the hardware lab, it's just getting there right now is t absolute pain. Mainly because I keep getting farther and farther from it. Well, by the time we get to the end of the game, we're gonna have the Q-Beam, and then I'm just going to be able to... Uh, use it freely because I'm gonna be so loaded with... ammo. Okay, wasn't there a... Uh, I don't remember. Suddenly I'm remembering there might have been a locked door that I could have unlocked along the way. It'd be nice if we get, like, uh, fast travel at some point. Maybe when I'm done with the game I'll turn on sheets and we can just go unlimited ammo. Just... Probably going to die here. Yeah, let's just let's just quick load. These guys are okay. Wow, that sucked. Let's go after the let's go after these guys before before we do anything else. Because. They came running. In a hurry. If I could actually carry this around. Maybe let's find something a little bit lighter. Okay. Okay, he spot... Did he spot me? Screw it. Okay, there's one. Hello? 
Come on. Really? Okay, now he's coming. Oh, there's a bunch of you guys. Okay, close enough. Bit of a waste. Guess I didn't charge my wrench up enough. Well, we're gonna be loaded with Q-beam cells by the time we're done. Anything? Yeah, there we go. Okay, Talia Brooks. Hey, a little bird told me you plugged a leak in an unconventional manner a few weeks ago. Yeah? Was it an ass-kissing bird named Krasikov? Maybe. Care to elaborate? Not if I'm going to get my pee-pee slapped. Worse. I'll dunk you in the eel tank. Ouch. Nah, supply was out of parts, so I borrowed a glue gun from the guys in hardware. Worked out okay. Ingenious. Next time, let's make sure we have enough spare parts to do the job right. Roger that, boss. Alright. I think that's enough murder machines. I guess I could have actually, like, um... I, I could have maybe recruited them. So how do we kill them all? Could check a recycler grenade in there. That'd be funny as shit. Bear glue cannon. Oh, that was, that was the guy that uh, we were just listening to. He did. Okay, anything else down here on the base level? We got a couple of doors that we can't get through. That's about it. Oh, I can get into the coolant chamber if I want. Let's go deal with the nightmare room first, I think. I mean, should be okay. Oh, I know how we can do it. Is there a flamethrower-like weapon? Not, uh, maybe the Q-beam. Maybe. 